So we can see here we have a fully moulded fibreglass shower cubicle. The shower cubicle goes all the way to the top whereby leaving no explode, exposed plywood. The entire cubicle is moulded from the outside right through to the inside. When stepping in and out of the shower, there can be no damage done to the bottom plywood here because it is fibreglass. In the days of old, this was a terrible uh, problem for us all because the plywood here used to get damaged through uh, people stepping in and out. Montana have gone a step further and put in a plastic curtain so all the water hits the curtain and none of the um, water gets to the aluminium. In some areas where the water is fairly harsh, it can react with aluminiums and uh, corrode it. So the idea of the curtain is that it protects it from that. You can, if you don't like curtains, it can quite simply unclip and um, you can throw it away. If you find that the curtain becomes soiled, you can go into Spotlight. Twelve dollars later, you've got yourself a new curtain. LED lights inside the shower cubicle. You can turn them off and on from a simple touch of a waterproof button. When using the hatch to evacuate steam from the shower, wind it up, turn the switch on, and it'll suck the condensed air out. When you've finished, switch it off, wind it down if it's raining, partially open it, turn it on all the same, it will still suck the condensed air out. Turn it up, wind it down firm, you're ready to travel. And once again, these little clips release, which allows that screen to pop out quite easily for cleaning purposes.